in a world where hopium and common sense collide. Starring the Crypto Keeper and Blockchain Crusader. Welcome to Debate Crypto. Crypto fam, it's your boy Crypto Keeper. I probably didn't need to tell you that because you knew, but I've got some exciting news. The 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 audit firm giant KPMG literally just bought Bitcoin and Ethereum. So before we jump into this article, I just want to want to want to kind of feel this a little bit. Some of the largest companies in the world are investing in the crypto space. You, because you're watching this video, are probably on the early adopter end of this. You most likely have invested before some of these massive institutions. So I want to give you a little bit of encouragement. You might be down right now. You might not. But if you are, you're still early. Patience. You've got this. Check this out. KPMG Canada adds Bitcoin and Ethereum to its balance sheet. The accounting giant is the latest big company to buy cryptocurrency. There's a sign of their, or a picture of their sign there. KPMG Canada today announced directly, in, it's a directly invested in Bitcoin and Ethereum, the two largest cryptocurrencies by market cap. The move is among the latest, gr among a growing trend of large institutional players to add cryptocurrency to their balance sheets, including MicroStrategy, Square, and Tesla. The Canadian arm of the accounting giant said in a Monday statement that the investment reflected their belief that the institutional adoption of crypto assets and blockchain technology will continue to grow and become a regular part of the asset mix. Uh, KPMG did not say how much that they invested, but they bought carbon offsets to maintain a net zero carbon transaction. Crypto assets are a maturing asset class, said Benji Thomas, Canadian Managing Partner, Advisory Services, KPMG in Canada. <clears throat> Investors such as head funds and family offices to large insurers and pension funds are increasingly gaining exposure to crypto assets and traditional financial services such as banks, financial advisors, and brokerages are exploring offering products and services involving crypto assets. Guys, I'm not going to dive much further into this. Uh, here's the deal. First of all, Canada uh, is a little more forward thinking than we are as it relates to crypto. Uh, they also have uh, some ETFs, you know, prior to us. And so I applaud them for that. Uh, but what I want to throw out there, guys, is that this is the, the, the calm before the storm. There might be ups, there might be downs, and there might be everything in between. But the reality is, holding Bitcoin, holding Ethereum, if it is profitable for some of the largest companies in the world, why can't it be profitable for you? And I really need you to think about that. Why can't it be profitable for you? I'm sure most of you have have, have looked at maybe a stock price at one point or another, and you're like, man, I owned that a while ago. Why did I sell that? Or, or you look at it and you say, man, I had the opportunity to, to buy that a long time ago, and I never did. Here's the reality. We don't know whether Bitcoin and, and Ethereum are going to continue to blast off toward, towards the upside like they are right now or whether they are going to turn around and dump back down. The reality is the only way you truly lose in these markets is by not getting involved. If you can get involved and be patient, you're going to be a winner. Obviously, none of this is financial advice because, you know, we've got to make sure to tell you that. But crypto fam, listen, you have an opportunity in front of you. Do your research. Make sure that this make sense for you figure out what bitcoin's about what ethereum is about what kind of changes it's making in the world that we that we see today and what we see or what you see moving into the future so crypto fam if nobody's told you before today i love you miguel loves you i'll speak for him on this one he's not here right now but we appreciate each and every one of you and until next time hodl like it's hot we will see you soon